Two Fish Talks. Hi everybody, welcome to Two Fish Talks. I'm Miss Brooke and this is Russ. <laughs> and we're here to keep reading in our one year Bible today. Are you ready? Let's go. David becomes king of all Israel. When the Philistine army came to fight against the Israelites, King Saul and three of his sons died. Jonathan was one of these sons. At first, David became king of just a part of Israel called Judah. One of Saul's sons became king over the other part. David ruled over Judah for seven years. Then two men murdered the son of Saul, who was king of the rest of Israel. After that, the leaders of all the tribes of Israel came to David. They asked David to be king over all of Israel. David made an agreement with the leaders, and they crowned him king. David ruled both Judah and Israel for 33 years. David led his soldiers against a group of people called the Jebusites. They had control of the city of Jerusalem. The Jebusites made fun of David. You'll never capture this great city, they said. But David sent some soldiers up through the water tunnel. They opened the gates and let the rest of the soldiers in. Then David's army captured the city. David gave Jerusalem a new name. He called it the City of David. He built the city up so it became even greater than it had been. As time passed, David himself became greater and more powerful than he had been before. That's because God was with him. A neighboring king sent cedar wood to help build a beautiful palace for David. The Lord was kind to David because David loved and honored him. Another reason why the Lord helped David was that he wanted to help all the people of Israel. Thanks so much for reading with us today in our one-year children's Bible. We'll be back again tomorrow to read more. Okay, Russ? <laughs> See you then. Bye-bye.